This video is about the Piano Sonata No. 23 Appassionata by Ludwig van Beethoven. I will explain the most important things about the work and the composer. Ludwig van Beethoven composed the Piano Sonata No. 23 between 1804 and 1805. He was in his mid-thirties at the time and living in Vienna. The sonata was written during a period when Beethoven was very productive. He was working on several major works at the same time. The sonata was published in 1807. It belongs to Beethoven's middle period, during which he developed his personal style. Piano Sonata No. 23 is also known as the Appassionata. This name means passionate in Italian. It was given to the work only after Beethoven's death. A publisher chose this title because he found the music particularly passionate. Beethoven himself simply called the sonata Great Sonata for the Hammerklavier. However, the name Appassionata has been retained to this day. The first movement begins with a quiet, mysterious theme. This theme is taken up and varied again and again in the course of the movement. The music quickly becomes very dramatic and passionate. Beethoven uses many fast runs and powerful chords. The movement has many contrasts between quiet and loud passages. It ends with a stormy coda. This movement is considered particularly expressive and emotional. The second movement is slower and has a calmer character. It consists of a theme with variations. The main theme is simple and almost choral like in the variations, it is changed and embellished in various ways. Towards the end of the movement, the music becomes more animated. However, the, the movement ends quietly again. It forms a contrast to the dramatic first and third movements. The third movement is fast and very energetic. It begins with a theme that surges upwards. This theme returns throughout the movement. The music is almost constantly in motion. Beethoven uses many technically difficult passages. The movement has a very virtuoso character. It ends with a wild, almost desperate coda. This movement is considered one of the most difficult Beethoven ever wrote. The Appassionata is considered one of Beethoven's most important piano sonatas. It is technically very demanding and uses the full range of the piano of the time. Beethoven experiments with extreme contrasts in volume and expression. The sonata has a very dramatic, almost theatrical character. It shows Beethoven's ability to express deep emotions musically. With the Appassionata, Beethoven cemented his reputation as the leading composer of his time. The work quickly became very famous and was often performed. It influenced many subsequent composers. For Beethoven himself, it was an important step in his artistic development. He proved that he could master and at the same time renew classical form. The sonata helped to establish Beethoven's international fame. The Appassionata is considered one of the most important works in the piano repertoire. It marks the beginning of the Romantic era in music. Many composers after Beethoven were inspired by this work. The sonata has often been analyzed and discussed in musicology. It has a firm place in music history and is considered a milestone in the development of the piano sonata. The Appassionata is now part of the standard repertoire of all great pianists. It is regularly performed in concert halls around the world. Many famous performers have recorded the work. The sonata plays an important role in music education. It is often required for competitions and entrance exams. The Appassionata still fascinates today with its expressiveness and technical brilliance. IT is considered one of the most important piano works ever.